it's Uncle Paul, and it is time to get rid of some fat clothes. <sighs> okay, let me tell you about my uh, stress test yesterday morning. It is Friday right now. It's nearly 11.30 in the morning. Uh, but yesterday morning early, I had my, my stress test. And uh, it every three minutes, they hook, got me all hooked up. Every three minutes, it would speed up and raise up a little bit, the incline, you know. And so I lasted uh, for seven minutes or a little more than seven minutes. Uh, and that last minute... Uh, was of me running, which I haven't done in in years. So uh, I finally said, "Okay." She said, "Whenever you know you can't go anymore, you know, just let me know." So I finally had to quit. But uh, and I recovered real quickly from that. It wasn't that that bad of an experience or anything. Uh, and I got the results this morning. You can log in. They, it's called my chart. And, and see the results. And they were up this morning, and you know, I didn't, there was nothing to compare it to, uh, so I didn't know what it showed particularly, but my doctor sent a note with it that said, great news, exclamation point, and then, you know, making sure, she wanted to make sure I was gonna be at my follow-up appointment this next Thursday. So, so that that's promising. Uh, now, Tuesday, I have an appointment to go in and put on uh, a heart monitor. And so that's going to show them probably a lot more, you know, information as well. So we'll see. We'll see what happens and, and if I need to be doing anything uh, in particular. So now uh, let's talk about clothes. Let's talk about what, I'm, what I call fat clothes. Obviously, I'm still fat. Still the clothes I wear are still fat clothes. But, of course, the clothes I'm talking about are, are clothes that, that I no longer can fit in anymore or... or, or that are way too baggy on me. So these shirts right here that I've worn to church, I've worn to uh, to for work, you know, substitute teaching, and the, this one in particular, y'all have seen many times in my in my videos, you know, and it's they're just this one's bigger than these. This is really baggy, and these are baggy enough, and plus. Uh, um, I've got a number of shirts that I fit into now and can shrink down into that I can work in or go to church in. So I'm just going to get rid of these. I'm going to take these to hospice. They're still in good shape. They're nice shirts. I'll, I'll donate them to hospice. This shirt, y'all know well if you've been watching my videos for a while, this was a hiking shirt I took on the AT in 2018 and last year in New Jersey. And it's just, I love it. It's comfortable. It's just way too baggy. It's way too baggy. So uh, it has served me well. Then these are, I've already thrown away some shorts. The ones that I hiked in last year that I bought to hike in in New Jersey, um, I already tossed those. They were just falling off of me. Same with these. I've been weighing in these. These are what I weigh in. Uh, and uh, because of the lightest pair of shorts that I have, but they're falling off of me now. They're just, I'm just going to chunk these because they're, they're just, they're torn up and everything, but they are dropping off of me. You know, I've got a bunch of these types of shirts, cheap $5 shirts, you know, that uh, I'm, these I'm just going to throw away because they're, they're, they're dirty. So anyway, going to get rid of all these fat clothes. There's more in there. But this is kind of exciting, though, right here. I'm keeping these. This is one that, that I'm growing down, or I'm losing down into. These shorts right here, these cargo shorts, these are the shorts that I wore in 2017, my first time out on the Appalachian Trail when I was weighing like 330 pounds. And, uh, you know, I'm about 15, 15 to 20 pounds heavier uh, than I was at that time, but as I was gaining weight back, I kind of stretched them out and everything. So they're, they don't t fit me perfectly, but well enough that I can wear them. <laughs> and I have been, it, it's kind of been fun. But you know, the pocket back here is all torn and the seam uh, here is uh, about to split back here, you know, so they're not gonna last much longer. They're a little bit grungy. 
but but I've been wearing these around around the house. They're too hot to hike in. So so that's exciting. That's that part's fun. Be able to, to get rid of fat clothes, or especially when you're you know uh, losing to be able to fit in, in in older clothes. So you know I, I'm not advising anybody what to do, but it's it's just if you if you uh, if you're trying to lose weight. Maybe if you've lost weight before and maybe gained it back, you know exactly what I'm talking about. If you if you are still on that journey and and, and you haven't, this is your first time to, to to lose a lot of weight, or you're trying to and you're morbidly obese, and I'm still that way. Uh, it, it's it is it is an exciting thing. It is a fun thing. It is something to, you know, to because to be honest with you you know like these shorts and other clothes that i've shrunk down into you know after i lose 10 or 15 pounds i'll go in there and try them all on again even though i know they're some of them aren't going to fit yet i i, I just want to see how much closer i am to fitting in them you know so it's just you know it motivates me it encourages me you know so so that's just another one of those reasons to keep plugging away to you know something to look forward to you know i um, there were, there's been times I've talked about this before that I wasn't sure that I'd ever get down to where I am now again. And, you know, I just wanted to say, uh, you know, I'm never going to be able to do it. You know, that I, I had been that low. I just think I'm not going to worry about it. I'm just going to be fat, get fatter. You know, that's just what my life's going to be. Didn't take long for me to snap out of those that kind of a negative mindset and attitude but i've been there before and so it just really feels good to know how much progress has been made i'm very thankful for that of course you guys have uh, have been a part of it and i know many of you have you know my channel's over four years now many of you have been with me all four years you've been with me for for three years now when i before i first went out on the appalachian trail and you've stuck with me through the through the ups and the downs and you've been very patient and and very encouraging and, and so i'm very thankful for that so we're going to get there we're going to get get down into new weight loss territory before too long uh and so I'm, I'm really looking forward to that and if you are in that same position you're trying to lose weight i know some of you've told me you've got goals you've got your own goals uh and some of them are for labor day weekend you know that's not real real far away so we can do it we can't give up we got to keep that positive mindset that positive attitude and keep working hard good sunday morning everybody all right well let's go get on the scale Okay, so last Sunday I weighed 354.6 pounds. Uh, this morning, this Sunday, I weighed 352.8 pounds, giving me a loss on the week of 1.8 pounds and a grand total since April 22nd, a loss of 85.6 pounds. Well, it's not as much as I would have liked to have lost, but it is still a loss and I will take it. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And Lord willing, I will see you on Wednesday.